Okay. So how far back did I go? Oh, okay. I'm, I'm literally right here then. Okay. Get down, get down, get down. To the right. To the left. Go get down, get down, get down, get down. Perfect. Stay in the blind spot. <gasps> oh, I thought that was going to get me. I so thought that was going to get me. Go. Go, 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 go. No. You didn't see anything. Shit. Nothing to see here. Oh, he's gonna get me. Yep. Go, 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 go. Okay. That's her, isn't it? Who's talking? Oh my god, dude. That is... That is some spooky level <clears throat> stuff right there. Sorry. I need to get a throat lozenge. I hate that child laugh. It's not spooky anymore because it is overplayed. And all I have to say is just, if you know that laugh, the child laugh, anytime you hear it in any movie or whatever, it is so overplayed, it's not, like, it's used for creepy, it's used for joy, it's used just kids being in, around each other, whatever. I fucking hate it. It's like the Wilhelm scream of sound effects. For kids, I should say. I, I just, I cannot stand it. Okay, that's a triangle and that looks like a square. So maybe I should be able to put this on the pedestal or on the little slot on the floor. This one. All right, one down, two to go. Okay. All right, now that I have the guide up so I could look to see exactly what I was doing wrong over here. Wait, what? What am I pushing on? What the fuck am I on? There's an invisible wall. There's an invisible wall right there. What was that? All right, so it told me to push on a bookshelf, which I'm assuming is this one. Yep, it had the skid marks there the whole time. This looks like a square. So this is the Indiana Jones puzzle. And I can open up. Not gonna lie, I do want a little like hidden wall. In the first house, there's at least one of the homes that I own. I want to have a hidden wall. Not for any like nefarious shit, but just like just to have it, you know. 
Like, I would feel like the Adams Family or like a Bruce Wayne kind of thing. Like, it's like, yeah, I got a hidden room. Uh-oh, why is the clock chiming? So long as that music keeps playing and she doesn't leave. Okay, yeah, she's still right there. You stay there, you creepy bitch. And we're fine. Okay, this, this. Okay. Now... If I was smart enough or had, you know, the ability to do like dual audio files, I would have played like the Indiana Jones music. But I mean, it, it was only, it'd be like that, da, 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 da. like it'd have been over that quick. Nope, that's the circle. Oh, that never is a good thing. Oh, there's someone up top. There's someone upstairs. Oh, shit. The music's gone. And of course she's... Wait, what the fuck are you? Yo, what are you? No, look down. I'm gonna get... I'm probably gonna get killed. Yeah. Because there's no way for... <clears throat> dumbass can't look... Sh like, can't aim it straight down. What was that? It looked like a little like shadow with a aim the flashlight with R. No fucking shit. That's what I was doing. He can't look it down though. What is that? Ah, no, no. I was aiming at it. This is her. Die! So you come. That's, that's, that, that's the child laugh. That's the one that I fucking hate. I'm aiming at it. What the fuck? All right, let's do this shit again. See? So, the, so they... Okay, this is fucking bullshit. I fucking hate that sound effect. No, fuck you! God damn it. Like, is this game trying to be survivor horror, puzzle horror, bullet hell? Like, I fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. No, fuck off.
No more. <clears throat> no more, you little shits. God, that fucking took way too fucking long. All right, there's one. Fuck you. Oh yeah, these little shits are going to be back here. There's no way they're not going to be. What's down here? Message in a bottle. Message in a bottle. Yeah, did you, <clears throat> I don't know if you guys know that uh, the Sting song, I'll Be Watching You, he actually wrote that as like the the guys are like as like a stalker. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Like, nope, nope. Die. Die, you piece of shit. Yeah, he wrote it as like if a, someone like was a stalker. Oh, I see you behind me. No! Like, what are these things? Come on. What are these things? No, no. Fuck you. Fucking die. Thank you. Jesus Christ. Nope. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. I have absolutely had it with you people. Like, they look like just shadows with a porcelain face. What's... What is the significance of that? Like, this is going to require me to go on YouTube and, like, do some <clears throat> comprehensive deep dives or whatever. Like the, what is that guy? Um, game Theory. Yeah, do some, like, Game Theory type sleuthing to figure out what that was. What the significant of it, significance of it is, because clearly you don't see anything about this until now. Yeah, they're oh, they're here. They're here again. I can Wait. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Boom, 2 for fucking 1. No, come on out. Worry. Oh, 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 you little shit trying to be sneaky. 
I'm fucking on to you. Alright, it's pretty quiet now. Yeah, this is this is reminding me of Dead Space. Yeah. I can climb this ladder though. If I can actually climb there. Get get on the ladder. Thank you. What is with that eye? Can't climb on top. What is down there? Looks like a red curtain. Like a theater curtain. Ready and do uh... Oh, there's... Yep. Fuck off with that stupid sound. Why do I have a feeling there's going to be like infinite number of these and I have to like spin the thing, defend myself, spin the thing, defend myself. And then there's a staircase painting, which means there's probably a staircase behind it. Like it's one of those like, oh, he's moving the wheel. Get him. called it. I so called it. I so called that. Okay. So pretty much I need to just get it low enough and run like hell. There's one. Fuck you. No, 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 no. I, I want to punch every single one of them in their fucking porcelain faces. Every single one of you. Like uh, Woody Harrelson in Zombieland. Now, I've never hit a kid before. Bill fucking Murray. I gotta watch that again. That was a good movie. Second one wasn't bad either. No, 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 no. No. Goodbye. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah. Yeah. Time to die, bitch. Go, just go, just go. No. Time to become Beethoven, motherfucker. Fuck your vase. Hey, the circle. Thought there was something... And what are you? Oh, a hidden liquor cabinet. Well, I mean, that was nice, but that didn't help me.
But no, seriously, if I ever do get one of those like hidden bookshelves or whatever, I would make sure it was like a book to release it and it would have to be the book Greed from Adam's Family. Straight up has to be. But it would put I'd put like all the seven deadly sins as a book as well. So it's kind of one of those like, well, which one is it? One will trigger an alarm. The other will trigger a polar bear. Like just just I don't know. I'm I'm spitballing and I'm trying to like not be as pissed about the porcelain children. Cause I don't know. Oh. That's what I need to do. Oh shit, there's one of them over here still, isn't there? Don't, don't, don't appear. Do not appear. Okay, cool. And there we go, all four pieces. And I managed to make them all facing to the right. That's kind of funny. Again, more broken mirrors. What is that noise? What is that noise? Oh shit, she's right there. Okay. What the fuck? What was wrong with her face? Her face had like jowls. Like she could like what is what that what that one Gungan from Star Wars episode one, the the commander? The, like she had like she could probably inflate those to attract a mate. Oh shit, she's following me. Oh, okay, that's not good. Hi there. Won't do me any good to turn my lights off. Because then I won't be able to see. Hey, that's not nice. Hey, a note. See, if I was a good enough editor, I would have done that. I would have put like, message in a bottle. Like every time I found one of those things. But I'm not a good editor. Is it down here? No. What's the fear of mannequins? Because I'm pretty sure... I mean, granted, they're not like full-blown mannequins, but... I don't have it. I don't think I know anybody, like, personally know anybody. The only person that I know that has, like, a fear of mannequins... I think Markiplier does. And that's honestly, that's one of the weird things. Like, I don't, like, I have slight arachnophobia. Like, if the, if the spider's in the room and he's not doing anything, I'm not going to mess with him. I'm fine. You know, I've worked, I've worked outdoors in the desert you know, right next to a little, like an entry point, And there was like a little stop sign and there was a black widow spider made a nest right by the stop sign, you know, and I, like, it didn't bother me. I didn't bother her. So it was no big deal. You know, bigger spiders, I got no problem with them. I actually want to hold like in my hand, I want to hold a tarantula just to be like, huh, 
that's what they feel like. That's what they look like kind of thing. But like, you know, if I'm sitting in a chair on my, at my computer and all of a sudden the spider runs across my keyboard or runs across the screen or whatever thing, I'm going to kill it. And if I can just squish it, that's fine. But if I can like rip a leg off or two, just kind of be like, you were warned. Or there's no warning shots, kind of. It's like, you're dead, motherfucker. Like, there was one day that I... It wasn't so much of a... Scared or freak out kind of thing. It was more of a super annoyance. I think I may have tweeted about it, or I just posted on my Facebook page. That a little bug, like, I think it was a silverfish, crawled... What? Am I dead? No! So all the gnomes are kids! Get the fuck out of here! All the gnomes are kids! Oh my god, wow! Okay. Huh. I mean, granted, that hasn't done... Wait. So I'm on the ship now. So I was on a ship the whole time. The dude over here on the left looks like a pig. But anyways, a silverfish crawled up into my TV and died dead center on my TV screen in between the light and the and the screen itself. So I had to like take off the frame. I had to undo a uh, a coat hanger wrap it in paper towels and like scrape out the fucking dead bug. I was so pissed because it's still like partially there because he's got so squeezed that all of his little like bug juices or whatever. You, like if I turn my TV screen, if it's like a white screen, you can see like dead center. There's a little like I can't get rid of it. It's not a, it's you know, it's you really aren't going to notice it all that Wait. Why does this look familiar? Oh my God. I, oh my God. Dude, I'm not going to lie. I just got chills. That's the gnome that I eat as six. Holy shit. We'll meet again. Wow. I mean, The Secrets of the Maw, it really didn't tell me anything, but that was a good DLC. I honestly think those first two DLCs were good, not great, but this one was a lot better. Because <clears throat> at least this one kind of, you know, tells the story of what happens to the runaway kid. Huh. Okay, so we're gonna we're just gonna ride out the credits out on this. See if maybe there's something at the very end of it or not. So I don't know. I wait. What did that say? I'm sorry about something. The coal man.
So is that supposed to be the sequel to two or like the, Oh no, that is the end. Huh. So, I mean, was that supposed to be like a hint that there was going to be another DLC or was that kind of like, we're making a sequel and here's our hint about it. Cause if so, that's not a good hint. That's just a, you know, that's like slender man appearing on TV. It's like, okay, cool. But Oh, well. All right, guys, we're going to wrap this up. I'm going to end this series and we're...